Hello friends. Welcome back to our channel Instrument Calibration. If you are new on this channel, and if you have missed our previous videos, then you can find links in the description box. And if you don't want to miss any informative video in future, then please subscribe this channel, and press bell icon to get notification, when we post new video on the channel. This is very short video on, 4 wire fully isolated transmitter. In this video, you will learn What is 4 wire transmitter, and what are the advantages and disadvantages of having 4 wire transmitter? Before we start this video, I want you to give the answer of this most frequently asked interview question. The question is, where should we terminate the shield cable? First option is, at panel side. Second option is, at transmitter side. The third option is, at both side. And the fourth option is, either transmitter side or panel side. If you know the answer, please type your answer in comment box. Now let's learn, what is 4-wire transmitter? As you can see from the diagram, in 4-wire transmitter, control panel and transmitter use separate power supplies. And this type of transmitter has two separate cores for 4 to 20 mA output. And power to drive the 4 to 20 mA loop is derived from the control panel. Let's learn, what are the advantages of having 4-wire transmitter? The most important advantages of having 4-wire transmitter is that, any electrical interference will not be transferred to the 4 to 20 mA signal line. Now, let's have a look on downside of this type of transmitter. First disadvantage is that, one additional cable core is required for this type of transmitter. In addition to this, separate power supply will require for transmitter and control panel. Thank you friends for watching this video. If you think our content is informative for you, then please press like button. And make sure to share this video with your friends.